Nicholas, Nicholas 555, suffering of general anxiety, panic attack, and this calmed down my panic attack, very relaxing and helpful. Um, as someone who suffered from anxiety myself, as someone who has suffered anxiety myself, comma, found ASMR videos to be a relief. I am deeply heartened to hear you are finding calm through my work. And I mean that. Uh, please look into CBT, Cognitive Behavioural Therapy, which I... Um, I went to and uh, was really, really helped by it. And this link, Mind, and it is a UK link, Mind.org, but this is what I found that um, led me to, to cognitive behavioural therapy. Um, so I just put that link and a smile face, and I'd give that a kiss, like a, um, a hug. Because uh, Mind and the cognitive behavioural therapy, Mind the charity, uh, are there for people who feel anxious. Cognitive behavioural therapy is the answer. Um, there's no, there's nothing negative about finding ways to handle a panic attack. But if you're just, <clears throat> if you're just countering the panic attack as it happens, then, you know, finding ASMR is brilliant because when you are panicking, you will calm down, but you're not stopping yourself from panicking in the first place. You're not addressing the reasons that you panic uh, in the first place so you're never actually going to get any better you're just going to stay the same and I encourage people to seek out the real cure for anxiety which is cognitive behavioural therapy it's not um, a psychological thing where people are going to mess with your mind it's not about sitting down and talking about all your problems and all your past it's about eight weeks one hour a week and you talk to someone who lets you talk about what you want to talk about and then offers you um, a coping strategy. A bit like how ASMR is a coping strategy for Isolis 555 at the moment. It offers you a different toolkit and a way that you can a way that you can use that yourself in your life and not be reliant on anyone else but yourself to feel relaxed and calm. And it really, really works. It really works. And if you go and you try it and it doesn't work, you've not lost anything. Um, no one's going to uh, lock you away for being a, a nut job or um, you know it's, it's not a course of drugs that's going to affect you it's just talking to someone and finding this toolkit mindfulness is the key word there I will be making videos about this in the future a lot of ASMR artists are making videos about anxiety because they're aware that anxious people watch their videos I'm not saying that anxiety and ASMR are linked because I think anxious people are up late at night looking for things to relax and ASMR is labelled that way on YouTube so it's no surprise that anxious people find ASMR and also find it relaxing. Um, but the real, the real cure for anxiety is cognitive behavioural therapy and I can't speak more highly about this nor the people that are engaged in offering it through the NHS in the UK. Um, I hope there are other sorts of services internationally and there are things, resources, mind will guide you to them uh, in order to, to start that process, to start that ball rolling. And like I said, I'm going to be making videos about it in the future. I think it's a really important subject that I want to handle correctly and something that's very close to my own personal experience. So I've not just waded in there and started shouting about it. Um, and I do think it's important that if you're finding solace in ASMR, that's brilliant, but it's not the answer. It's not a therapy for your anxiety. It's not going to alleviate it in the long term. The things that you're anxious about are not going to go away because you watch a video. So you can learn to think differently about things and to combat and counteract the, the anxiety. And cognitive behavioural therapy is the way to go for that. So thank you for that comment. Thank you.